trash and found a material that she used, wanted to use as her medium of art. On a typical day, doing chores, she looked in her laundry and found dryer lids. Hooper had been more of a metalsmither before her experience with cancer. Surgery on her right arm to remove the growth had significantly weakened her muscles since much was removed. This led her to work with easier material, even taking the surprising turn to dry Ireland. Her work still takes very long to make due to her weak arm. This shows her true dedication to each of her pieces and each image must portray something she truly cares about. This is Obama, one of the many pieces this creative woman has put together with her now beautiful laundry dust. The artwork depicts the first black president of the United States. This is a historical marker in modern times and will be well remembered through the future. The 21st century has battled many social issues, attempting to fully end racism and stereotypes by spreading open-mindedness throughout America and bringing someone other than a white man into presidency is a huge step in such a process. With the past viewing colored people as subordinates, placing such a human as head of the entire country proves that that perspective is truly being washed away. Obama's composition focuses greatly on the intensity of the eye contact between the two characters. They balance the artwork and amplify the horizontal plane with their gaze, and this integral focus of the art is augmented by the many red and white horizontal stripes in the background. The viewer bounces his gaze between the two figures. However, the trunk leads straight down to the elephant's tusk, and this tusk points straight to Obama's heart. This could be symbolic of the president's care for the country, his job, and the political positions he stands by. The colors are mostly dull due to what the art is made out of, and there is not a wide variety of hues presented. The texture of this artwork reflects the material dusty and soft as lint. However, the artist does not fail to express strength and power through sharp, defined edges in necessary places, such as Obama's eyes and chin and the red stripes of the American flag in the background. There is plentiful symbolism presented in this piece. The president's big ear is a caricature trait that the artist uses to help the viewers recognize who the man is. His big yet gentle eyes gazing straight into the elephants gives an intense feel to the image, showing his seriousness and sincerity. The animal is symbolic of his opposing political party, and their strong, level gaze shows their equality and valued importance even through their different political views. The background shows his pride for his country. This also expresses strong nationalistic value for the artwork. Obama is considered an American hero, and this work shows Hooper's pride for this man, his achievements, and the accomplishments of her culture and country. It is also representational of the environmentalist views of the time period. This century has been focused heavily on improving the environment by reducing our use, recycling what we use, and reusing what we have used. Since dryer lint is most commonly seen as waste, Hooper is acting environmentally and turning this dust into masterpieces. This art is influenced by postmodernism, which is a movement that amplifies the media and uses unique material to present a pop culture figure or idea. Obama presents the president, a man clearly in the center of the media. It is similar to Shepard Fairey's Hope, which is as well postmodern and shows an image of the first black president. His piece of art utilizes contrast to create an effect on its viewers, and the big and bold word is meant to directly link the man with a positive influence and in what he intends to bring to America. Fairey's work has a bit of subliminal messaging in this way, attempting to persuade the audience to favor this presidential candidate, whereas Hooper's is more informative and a presentation of her pride for her leader. While they both represent the same man, the artists go about this in these separate ways. This piece is incredibly unique in that it uses dust from laundry, a waste product that anyone would look over and discard, to create something remarkable. Being somewhat of an environmentalist myself, I adore this way of creating art. The image is also very powerful and depicts a, a historical event that moved many people I know. The artist did a fantastic job, even through her own personal troubles that I find very inspiring. The many meanings behind this piece satisfy me and my opinions on current events, modern day, and our environment. As a whole, I find this piece and all of Hooper's other works amazing, beautiful, and extremely creative. Thank you for joining me and listening to this presentation of Heidi Hooper's Obama.